problem 259 or 357 for both textbooks for details please see the description below the steam requirements of the manufacturing facility are being met at a boiler whose rated heat input is equal to 5.5 times 10 to the 6 BTUs per hour the combustion efficiency of the of the boiler is measured to be 0.7 by a handheld fuel gas analyzer after tuning up the boiler, the combustion efficiency was raised to 0.8. The boiler operates on and off for 4,200 hours in a year, taking the unit uh, cost of energy to be $4.35 per 10 to the 6 BTU. We need to determine the annual energy and the cost saving as a result of tuning up the boiler. Here is a list of the known values for the problem and what we need to find. And for the assumptions, we're going to use the boiler to operate a food load when it is in service. The solution of this problem is simply based on efficiency. So if we reduce the definition of efficiency, we have what is the amount of um, energy leaving and the amount of energy going in. For the problem, we know the amount of energy that is going in before it was, the boiler was tuned up and that will give us an amount of energy out. The only thing that we know in both cases, whether you have a um, more or less efficient device is that the amount of energy uh, living is going to be exactly the same. And then ideally when the efficiency is higher, the amount of energy going in, which is required to run, is gonna be lower, therefore um, reducing the cost that we're going to have. So for the case one, so we're going to simply write the case one, we're going to calculate the amount of Q out, and that is going to be equal to the efficiency and the amount of Q in. In that case, we have 0.7, and then we have 5.5 uh, and 10 to the 6 uh, BTU per hour. And that gives us 3.85 times 10 to the 6 BTU per hour. So once again, this value is the same for both cases uh, since uh, the output of both devices has to be exactly the same. What is going to make a difference is how much it consumes and therefore it has lower cost. So for case two, what we want to find out is we want to find out what is the amount that is going in. So in that case, the amount of QN uh, for the second case is going to be the same Q out that we had for the previous case and the efficiency after the boiler was turned up. So that was 3.85 times 10 to the sixth BTU per hour divided by 0.8. And that gives us 4.81, 25 times 10 to the sixth uh, BTU per hour. So notice that we the before it was tuned up, it used 5.5 times 10 to the 6 BTU per hour. Now the consumption got reduced to 4.8125. So what we need to find is uh, to find out the cost, we first need to find out what is the difference between the two values. So we have 5.5 minus 4.8125, and this is all times 10 to the 6. BTU per hour. This value gives us 6.875 times 10 to the fifth BTU hours. Okay. Now, if we multiply that value by the cost of the um, quantity, and by the time that it runs, it allows us to find out how much it was saved. So, if we take this value, 6.875 times 10 to the fifth. BTU per hour. The device runs for 4,200 hours. And then we said that the cost is going to be $4.35 um, every 10 to the sixth BTUs. Then we could cancel BTUs and BTUs, hours and hours. And the final value is going to be cost and tells us that by doing this tuning, we're going to save $12,589.50 per year. 
So notice that for us to be able to say to solve this problem, we were able to determine the amount of um, rate of energy out, and it's exactly the same for the boiler before and after. We then calculated the energy in once it was tuned up. We calculated the difference between them, multiplied by how long it ran for and the cost, and that will give us the savings.